I am Diana Driscoll and I'm an independent researcher here at the British Museum and I have been working with Cox and Kings for the last eight years as a lecturer and I go attend their arts and culture tours to Morocco and Uzbekistan and Iran. At the British Museum I also give talks regularly in the galleries on the Silk Road and I have would like today to tell you something about the arts and culture tours and why they're different from the other tours that you could attend on Cox and Kings. Cox and Kings has a wonderful group of guides in country, but there are tours now, arts and cultures, culture that is attended by people like myself who are lecturers in the field. We want to make it a little bit different, or very different from the other, other tours that you can attend. People who come on our tours usually have some kind of interest in the area that is a, and would like to know a little bit more. So what we do as lecturers is we go beyond what the guides will tell you. We will take you to places that the guides would not take you to. For instance, in Iran, I've taken people to a miniaturist who did a tiny miniature for me to take home calligraphers, tile makers, and in Uzbekistan we go to people who still do Islamic pottery in the old method that you'd find from the 9th century and they give us a demonstration on this type of pottery. Other lecturers will take you to various other um, various houses or museums that you would not have access to. For instance, also in Uzbekistan, we go to a very secret museum in the north of Uzbekistan, which has the second largest collection of Soviet avant-garde art in the world. So on these arts and crafts, arts and cultures tours, we try to make it much more interesting. We give you handouts. We take you to museum, the museums. We talk about the art. We talk about how it was made. We talk about the buildings that you'll be attending. We will talk about how these buildings were built. Who were the artists, the artisans? Who were the craftsmen who put these buildings together? We take you through the decorative sections of the buildings and explain to you a bit more so your photographs and your memories will be enhanced by what you have heard. Now you mustn't think that you have to be a semi-academic to come on these tours. Not at all. Not at all. We're there if you have an interest. You could have read a poem. You could have seen Lawrence of Arabia six times. You could have always wanted to ride a camel. It doesn't make any difference. But when you leave after our two or three weeks with me or others, you will have a much richer, fuller, more interested appreciation of the place you've come to. Because we want to make it not special, but extra special. So I hope you join us.